Uh, this stretch of the river is where our Nature Links project is focused uh, in the main from Narromine to Warren. And so here at Gingin, we're right in the heartland of that. We're working with 26 farmers along this stretch of the river doing weed control, uh, restoration of uh, riparian country uh, along just over 100 kilometres of the, of the river through this stretch. And so it was quite complimentary you know, to be able to also put money towards controlling uh, pigs and foxes. The Central West Local Land Services um, currently is managing the project between Bundamar, the, the landholders group, and uh, the River Smart organisations. Well, River Smart is, has come on board and done a fantastic thing in giving us money to help as along keep that feral pig population away from the river. Uh, as well as some of the work they can do on weed control and, um, and cedar trees and rehab and revegetating the areas like they did down at the uh, Gingin Bridge down here. It looks amazing down there. Everybody relies on this river in one way, either economically, um, but there's also a very strong social and you know, recreational linkage with the river. Most people fish and swim and enjoy the river. So keeping it healthy is important. We know a pig can eat two lambs a night and so on these days in current prices you know a lamb is worth hundred dollars so if a pig eats two lambs a night that's two hundred dollars a night. Um, if we can shoot him for um, twenty three dollars then obviously you know we, we've got a gain. When they get in the cropping they uh, knock it down, knock big areas down. The damage that feral pigs can do, um, destroying riparian habitats, accelerating erosion and impacting on water quality and foxes of course you know just have an impact on native wildlife. Our uh, federally funded NatureLinks project we decided it was uh, important to also uh, invest some of that money in, in feral pig and fox control and so uh, working with uh, Central West Local Land Services we've met up with the Bundamar group and, and have put money towards that program uh, which will enable several shoots, fox baiting, pig baiting and so you know to date it's been very successful. I think the important thing as a group is you cover a bigger area. I mean, if each person just does it on their place, I mean, a fox travels nine kilometres in a night, you know, 24 hours or something, a pig travels 50 kilometres. So unless you're doing a big area, then really it's, it's, it's like um, throwing confetti in the air. It just, you know, doesn't go anywhere. It's, it's that group thing allows you to do a lot more than if you just did it by yourself. It's a coordinated approach to pest animal control. So it's working with your neighbours within, within the community. Um, more area covered, uh, a larger time before reinfestation occurs, and basically everyone, um, you know, everyone working together to achieve a common goal is always good for a community like this. The community that we're in at the moment, the Bunamar areas, that, you know, they, they have a very strong working relationship with each other, so it's uh, it's made our job quite easy to put it together. It's been a real pleasure to work with these guys up here. They, you know, they all respect each other, and, and you know, they know how to work together. Uh, the communication there is fantastic and you know, it just makes being able to manage that, that project relatively easy. Well, the shooting is very specific, it's just one part of the program. You still don't clean it all up 100% so there's, you're always doing other things. Hats off to these guys up here, you know, that they, they do an absolute fantastic, fantastic job keeping the thrill pig numbers down with, with an integrated approach. You know, a lot of these guys bait and a lot of these guys trap. Um, you know, the aerial shooting is only one single component that happens twice a year here, but these guys, you know, they work all year round trapping and baiting, so, you know, big congratulations to these guys to keep it going forward.